Hi, we're at the FSP stand at CBIT 2011. I'm here with Sabrina, and FSP is actually changing tack for this year. We've got a lot more focus on retail power supply units. So Sabrina, first, give us a bit of history about FSP and why the change from OEM to retail. Okay, uh, I'm Sabrina. Uh, this is the FSP booth. So I would like to introduce a little bit about our uh, company this year. I think you can feel a lot. Our company are very different this year. Yeah. Most of the time, our company color are green and uh, blue. But what's the reason you can see here? Uh, we have different color here. And so what does that mean? A change in color? A change in fortune? Yeah. I think, uh, no, not really. See, uh, this is uh, uh, 80 plus gold series, so we call album. Then you can feel it's all black and uh, uh, gold color together because we want to let people understand uh, this, uh, we really uh, decide to change our company image from these new products. Uh, this new products de we designed from uh, FSP is a company for OEM company for many many years and uh, most of the time uh, I think we produce for a lot of uh, uh, customer company for their OEM power supply but as uh, everybody know OEM business is getting uh, less profit uh, than before so finally we understand if we can produce good quality product why don't we uh, create our own brand. Right. So in recap, FSP wants a much, much bigger footprint in the retail market. Yeah. And to do that, you've got a new colour scheme, new technology, and a much, much larger focus. Yeah. Okay, so if we go with Albert, okay. and Thank we'll you. discuss more of the technical aspects. Okay. Right. I'm here with Albert, who's the technical maestro behind FSP. We're going to talk a bit more about the Aurum power supplies. So Albert, Aurum, new colour scheme, new technology. Can you just give us an overview of what's new with this series? Basically, okay, let me hold this. Basically, this, take, uh, this time that we have uh, for our awareness, okay, three types of technology. So first of all, the uh, the controlling us is we made the controlling us ourselves. This controlling us, FSP spent three years dedicated to control uh, with the, this new uh, topology that we have here. Um, and secondly, we have this area flow technology. Due to the different size of the surface area, we're able to create a natural reflection and also physical properties that to extract this heat easier and faster. And thirdly, we have this um, hybrid synergy. Normally, that um, the OCPs always always limits um, the current that can be used, being utilized by by high uh, 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 high in graphics card. Yeah. And now we are able to shifting the current to wherever it needed. So you can tell that Albert's really, really technical. I understood a lot of that, but not all of it. So just to recap, you've got new ICs, which make it smoother power. The controlling ICs. Yeah, you've got this new airflow technology Correct. with the ventilation holes that should allow for much, much better airflow through the system, yes, through the power correct. supply. And this new design rail for, again, better efficiency. Correct, sir. OK. And also, this is a sample of it. Okay, in terms of the new coating as well, once you have, you can change to from case to cases that you won't get scratched. These coatings are so hard that if I scratch it, let me try. Let me what? try it. Okay, you can wipe it off. That's why whatever comes out is the nail. Okay. All right. Okay, let's so, take a look. Yeah. In terms of capacities, what do you have? And you've also got modular and non-modular power supplies, Correct. haven't you? So give us a rundown of the series. All right. Uh, for the non-modulars, we have a uh, ranging from 400 to 700. And for the modulars, we have uh, 6550, 650, and 750, and they come with uh, flat cables. They don't come with a normal uh, with nylon sleeve, nylon right. sleeves. And now, but sorry, just to pull you back here, these yeah. are available now, the modular ones. These non modular, are, sorry. The non modular ones are available right now. Right now. And when the modular ones will be available? It should be by the end of May. Okay. So if we move on up, we've got some larger power supplies here. Okay. So what's the big yeah. difference here? Uh, we made we call it a Pro Series, which comes with single rail, mm -hmm. single rail 12 volt design, and also the big fan. Right. Okay. We leave. Just how big is yeah. that fan? Uh, it's 13.5 okay. centimeter. And single rail benefits the enthusiast how? Correct. What's the, you, what's the thinking behind that? Yeah, because we decided okay, these are different. Okay, these are multi rails because first of all, we want to protect our end users mm -hmm. and their systems. First of all, they might not have so much knowledge of technical knowledge to protect their own systems. And for these one, for, uh, for the real enthusiastics, that they are able to control the system themselves. They know exactly how, how it's happening. Okay. And if we move on up, you've got something very, very special in the corner. Right. Give us a few words about this and what it is and why it's important for FSP. 
this is so important. This is the best power best, uh, uh, power supply you could buy. Okay, the best power best supply in the world. Correct, sir. Okay, the man said it's the best power supply in the world. Okay, so tell me why. This is the platinum, all right. Okay. And uh, we also decide to change um, a different image from the from the old UFSP image. That um, uh, this is under testing, and we're we're planning to do 400 to 700 at this point in time. Right. And looking towards the future, when will it be available? Give us the best we guess. Would say, we would say uh, by the end, before the end of the year. Yeah. And in a few words, recap why I should, or our readers should buy FSP power supplies. First of all, okay, uh, FSP has decided that we want to bring eco power into every single home and every single office. And we don't want just these powers for high-end users. We want we have this we have this dream that as a as a uh, manu professional manu uh, manufacturer that we want to have the best power for every single person on earth. Okay, well that's Albert's reasoning why you should buy FSP power supplies. We'll be putting these through the test when they come through the labs. But until then, tune back for more from Hexus TV.